Hi, I'm Tim Ritchie, professional runner for Saucony and a member of the Boston-based Freedom Track Club. I was the 2017 U.S. Marathon Champion and currently preparing for the 2018 Boston Marathon. This is the brand new Saucony Ride ISO. So I just got my hands on this shoe and from the first time I put it on, I really liked the new ISO upper, a really comfortable feel. This is the first generation of the ride that has the ISOFIT lacing. It also has Everrun cushioning through it. And the latest thing is the form fit, which as soon as you've put your foot into the shoe, uh, you'll feel it contour to your foot. The Saucony Guide ISO is my go-to everyday shoe. So I'll use it for recovery runs, long runs, and my daily distance run. So this is a moderate stability shoe from the Saucony lineup. So it's got a, a post to kind of give me a little bit of guidance through my ride. I've worn the guide since its first generation. Um, and the newest one is the first one that has the ISO fit upper, uh, which I really love because it, it hugs my foot and in a very comfortable sportive way. This is the Saucony Fast Twitch 8. This is my primary workout and racing shoe. Uh, for workouts, I'll use it anything from a 200 meter or 400 meter fast repetition all the way up to my moderate distance tempo runs. And then racing, I'll wear this shoe on any road race from 5K to marathon. I actually won the 2017 marathon championships in this pair of shoes. Out of all of Saucony's road racing shoes, this is the one that does provide a bit of stability to it, uh, which is great for me, especially as the race distance gets longer. This is the Saucony Hurricane ISO 4. I just started working the Hurricane into my rotation. I use it primarily for my easy recovery days. Um, it's got a great amount of support to it, and it's all ever run. And so on those days where my body's feeling really fatigued, it's nice to have the maximum support and the maximum cushioning to get me through the run. This is the Saucony Liberty ISO. And this shoe's great for me because it has uh, a bit of a post in it, so it provides me a touch of guidance for these long workouts. But it is all ever run from heel to toe, so it gives me that consistent cushioning throughout the whole run. So this is a brand new shoe for Saucony starting in 2017 but like the guy that has the ISOFIT upper, so it still has that same kind of comforting feel to it.